tell them God bless you. Christians believe Israel is the holy city where Christianity began. Pentecostal believers assert that it is their duty to pray for peace and seek an end to the conflict. Bishop Joshua Mlinge from Kenya emphasized the importance of prayer for peace, stating that such efforts can foster reconciliation. He urged other religious leaders to join in prayer for Israel. Israel are the roots of Christianity. So anyone, even without being a Christian, who hate his roots, you hate your parents, you hate your father, you hate your mother, it's a curse. So God says in Genesis chapter 12 verse 3, he will bless those who bless the roots of the humanity being blessed. So this conference is for people of all churches, it's for all people who will say they desire to see God's blessings on all nations. Even non-Christians are most welcome as long as they will desire the pattern of God, of God blessing all the nations. Teddy Chuonka, director of the Africa-Israel Initiative, called on Ugandans and religious leaders to advocate for peace and reconciliation in Israel. The global organization founded in Norway aims to promote prayers for peace and an end to the conflict. We are here to, to, to really encourage everybody to be part of the African initiative of praying for Israel, loving Israel. And also, this is what God gave us. For God loved us and he gave us his only son. And so it is a moment where we can show love. And how can you do it is by prayer. How can you do it is by reconciliation. Because our ministry is about reconciliation. He wants us to reconcile where things are very bad. We can be a part in the reconciliation process. We need to love our brothers, the Arabs, the people who are involved in this, the people who are really, really bitter, we can love them. We are here at Kappa Evangelical Free Church in a conference with a theme, Pray for the Peace of Jerusalem. When the churches, the pastors, the bishops, wherever you are, we are on the branches. We are grafted into the tree of salvation from the Jews. Chibedi Bashir and Stephen Kayumba for UBC. Oh,